There are many diverse and upscale midsize SUVs for you to choose from with excellent ratings for dependability. But then there are models that you should avoid if you want a smooth car ownership experience. Let's take a look at five of the least reliable 2021 midsize SUVs that could potentially cause you some annoying problems. The SUVs on this list are based on Consumer Reports reliability ratings. CRs determine a vehicle's reliability based on its scientific auto survey and model samples. Furthermore, the organization also tests a car based on 17 potential trouble spots, including its engine and electrical system. Counting order goes down to the least reliable. Before we get started, please subscribe and turn on the bell button to get the latest updates about new videos. Number 5. 2021 Jeep Wrangler The Jeep Wrangler is an okay SUV, but its specialized nature means it's likely to be either your first buying choice or your last. The Wrangler is a supremely good off-road machine, and it offers some capable powertrains, including a new for 2021 plug-in hybrid. However, the Wrangler trails many, if not all, other compact SUVs in areas that don't deal with rugged capability. Its base engine underwhelms, and the optional diesel powertrain is the only one that lets you even approach class average fuel economy ratings. Many rivals provide smoother rides and superior handling. The 2021 Jeep Wrangler scored better than the other midsize SUVs on this list. This iconic Jeep received a 27 out of 100 for dependability, but this score is still below average, making it one of the least reliable 2021 midsize SUVs. Consumer Reports admits that the Jeep Wrangler has made improvements over the years, but its unimpressive score reflects persisting issues with its steering, suspension, and power equipment. Jeep covers the Wrangler with a 3-year, 36,000-mile limited warranty and a 5-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. Number 4. 2021 Volkswagen Atlas The Volkswagen Atlas is another attractive SUV with poor reliability ratings. This Volkswagen appeals with its European style and ample interior space. It's also among the smoothest rides in the midsize SUV class. It's available in two and three row variants. Both provide generous seating space and cargo room. Along with many standard driver assistance features, including blind spot monitoring and forward collision warning, the Atlas earns praise for its easy to use infotainment system, which supports Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. It also rides and handles well for an SUV of its size. That being said, the Atlas could benefit from a stronger engine lineup and nicer cabin materials. Still, it has a few problems that are hard to overlook. The Volkswagen Atlas gets 19 out of 100 for predicted reliability. Consumer Reports data shows that the Atlas's most common problem areas include its emissions fuel system, exhaust system, engine minor, and climate system. Other downsides to the Atlas are its lack of agility, fuel economy, and quickness. Conversely, the Toyota Highlander is the more well-rounded pick. The 2021 Volkswagen Atlas is covered by a 4-year, 50,000-mile limited warranty. Number 3. 2021 Subaru Ascent What a fall! For 2020, the Subaru Ascent was among Consumer Reports' most raved about models. CR recognized this Subi for its luxury-like ride quality and decent off-road potential. This Subaru's standard all-wheel drive gives it excellent road grip, and the suspension system is tuned for a relaxed ride over rough roads. Inside, the Ascent can accommodate adults in all three rows, and every trim is equipped with an array of advanced safety technology. On the downside, it has one of the worst predicted reliability ratings in the class. The 2021 Ascent has taken a turn for the worse. Predicted reliability is 18 out of 100. Reported trouble spots for the Ascent includes its transmission major minor, steering, suspension, in-car electronics, and climate system. These problems indicate an unsatisfactory owner experience. Some people have even taken to Reddit to say that repairs were delayed because Subaru lacked necessary parts. Subaru covers the Ascent with a 3-year, 36,000-mile limited warranty and a 5-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. Number 2. 2021 Dodge Durango The Dodge Durango has plenty of positives that help make it a good mid-size SUV. It serves up welcoming seating for up to 7, along with a slick infotainment system. In true Dodge fashion, it has several powerful V8 engine options, including a new for 2021 710 horsepower Hellcat version. While it's far from the most athletic SUV in the class, 
the Durango delivers a supple ride. Noted weaknesses include a somewhat lethargic base engine, mixed interior quality and lower trims, and subpar crash test results. The Dodge Durango isn't one of the most complained about FCA vehicles, but it doesn't get the best reliability ratings. Consumer Reports gave this beastly midsize SUV a 16 out of 100 for predicted reliability. This low score reflects the trouble spots in the 2018 Durango that included its fuel system and climate system. Owners have also complained about the Durango's in-car electronics, suspension, and paint trim. On the flip side, the 2021 Durango did well in Consumer Reports road tests. The team appreciated its comfortable ride quality and excellent towing capabilities. The 2021 Dodge Durango comes with a 3-year, 36,000-mile basic warranty and a 5-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. And number 1. The Least Reliable 2021 Midsize SUV – Ford Explorer The Ford Explorer is a good SUV. It has a lineup of potent turbocharged engines, gets good gas mileage, and delivers a smooth ride. It also has plenty of cargo space and a long list of standard features that include several active safety technologies and an intuitive infotainment system. However, the Explorer's second and third row seats aren't as spacious or comfortable as those of many rivals, and the cabin quality is lackluster, owing to lots of low-rent materials. The Explorer, among other Ford SUVs, have been extremely problematic this year. Ford did too many redesigns in one year which significantly dropped the carmaker's reliability rankings for 2021. In particular, the all-new 2020 Explorer debuted with extensive problems. Consumer Reports gave the 2021 Explorer a 1 out of 100 for reliability. <laughs> you serious? That's one of the lowest scores in Consumer Reports' auto survey for the year. Owners told Consumer Reports that they had to get transmission replacements and had other issues with the SUV's engine, drive system, electronics, and power equipment. The Ford Explorer comes with a 3-year, 36,000-mile basic warranty and a 5-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe and hit the bell button to hear about our upcoming videos if you haven't done so yet. Stay tuned.